last film is from Sarah, who talks about a woman from her community that inspires her. So, what I want to talk to you with you about today is um, my Oma and Oba. Mm -hmm. I was very privileged to meet your grandma. See, I'm saying grandma and grandpa, Oma and Oba, okay? And, um, <clears throat> and we lived, were neighbors, and we, uh, occasionally, we would come to each other's houses and have FOSPA. You know what FOSPA is? That, no, you don't know what FASPA is. Explain what FASPA is. You know, FASPA is a cup of tea with some sweets. And then they moved to uh, to BC. Oh, many years later, who shows up in our door? And your grandma and grandpa moved here, and there were three little children. <laughs> and, it, ah, and they lived about a mile and a half from our place. Yeah. And, oh. We got to know them so well, and I, you know, your grandma is my best friend, and always has been, and is still, and I think uh, uh, Jake thinks the same about uh, your grandpa. Very special people. Your mother decided to get married. Before we knew it, there were three little children in that <laughs> household and one and, and one special girl that I always thought was very special was Sarah Payne. And you know why? Why? It's because my mother's name was Sarah and that meant a lot to me. I didn't have girls. I could call them Sarah. I think my mother would have loved to have a little girl of course. Uh, named Sarah and uh, but uh, I couldn't name the boys uh, Sarah just what we girls were or uh, skirts or dresses and the boys were, wore kind of overalls kind of thing and uh, yes and it took a long time that one year, we girls uh, said we had to tell our mothers we wanted slacks. Or... Yeah. And so, and it's yes. really true. Oh, and, I and, believe and you. And we all got them the same year. We went to Sunday school. And, I like Sunday school. And then we, um, as we got a little older, then we would be included in the message. What did you think of uh, oh my, let's see if I can do that yet. See, oh look, Mrs. Tisa's got it. She knows how to do that. <laughs> Thanks for watching Canada's History Through the Eyes of Young Citizens. For more information, visit youngcitizens.ca.